Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I am going to go over a haul with you. Um, so I recently went to Staples because my husband needed, um, I don't know what he needed. He needed something. Uh, like, I think he needed refills for his pen. I don't remember. Anyway, so we went to Staples and um, I got some stuff there. And so I'm going to show you guys that first, and then I'm going to show you what I got at Peachy Cheap, which if you guys haven't seen or heard of that website, oh my gosh, need to go. Okay, so I'm just going to unload everything here, which I probably should have done before the video started because it's really loud, but I didn't really get that much as I unload this bag full of stuff. <laughs> so, okay, that's it. That's, that's all I got. So I got these ginormous binder clips because um, I use them in organization, like uh, keeping wires and such together. Right now I'm using tiny ones. Oh, let me switch over. Right now I'm using tiny ones and I have to basically only group together part of it to kind of keep it organized. So, and it'll work for stuff like this because it's super small, but for bigger things, for bigger quartz, I need the bigger clips. So I got the bigger clips. Um, and I got some sparkle gel pens because, well, I sell them and I don't have any sparkle gel pens. And I have a kind of crazy, unhealthy obsession with pens. Um, or pencils like seriously guys y'all should see my pencils I have like we're not even talk about that so anyway I got sparkle pens uh, and those are gonna stay at my desk oh these were really cool so it looks like this one goes in a dispenser I'm not sure but anyway um, actually I think they all do yeah they did all do okay so anyway, this looks like it's a uh, meant for a dispenser of some sort. Like, I don't know if you guys can see that in there. Um, but I actually got these while I was at the register. Uh, I was sitting there, you know, checking out or whatever. And I looked down and I was like, wait, is that washi? And it was. And they were 50 cents a roll. They were on clearance. I have no idea why. But... I got them. The only color I did not get was green because I know for a fact that I have solid green. It may not have been the same shade, but I actually have a lot of green washi, which is weird, <laughs> I think. But um, I have a lot of green washi in variation, whether it's solid or print or, you know, whatever. But so I got some of these and I just got one of each color except for the green. And that was the clearance washi my husband actually was joking around he was just like I don't think you need more washi when you have all of the washi in the world and I'm like oh I don't really have all of the washi in the world otherwise our entire house would be filled with washi and I don't think that's really the case <laughs> so I don't know if these were regular price or not but they were marked and rang up for 99 cents so um, I don't know if they're regular priced or not, but I got a couple of them because I really like purple and it, it really matches the theme of what's going on in my art room now. And I'm doing a lot of organization, like reorganization as I'm like putting my art room back together. Um, so if this is your first time visiting my channel, uh, my husband got me a new desk for, I don't really know why, it just because I needed one. So he bought one. And in the process of buying this desk, this desk is actually kind of complicating. It's an L-shaped desk and it's got a hutch on that side over there and it has a bookshelf to it and it has a filing cabinet to it. So it's like a, it's a desk system or an office system. Anyway, point being is in order to put it all together, I had to completely empty my room. So I took everything out of my art room. The only thing that stayed in my art room was my paper bookshelf because it's kind of a pain in the ass to empty and move and then fill back up so I was like yeah no you can work around that so I completely emptied my room 
he put the desk together, put the hutch together, put the bookshelf together. Filing cabinet he went to put together and it, the thing was broken. So um, the, the back piece that kind of like holds it all together was cracked in half. So we had to order another replacement part. So um, my room was like halfway sort of kind of organized, but I knew that I was going to do a lot with that filing cabinet. So I couldn't really do a, a lot with it. Anyway, so it finally got put together and now I'm finally getting to where I can really put everything where I know I want it because there's no more additions coming into the room. Um, we actually downsized, believe it or not. Like we took out a lot to put the desk in because the desk is, like I said, it's a little ridiculous. Anyway, that's why I bought these. That was a really long story. <laughs> But um, that's why I bought these because I'm doing a lot of the um, organization as I'm going through everything. Um, I've already given away, um, I had talked to a friend of mine and I was going to do like, you know, de-stash this and de-stash that. But I have a friend of mine that came over. Hi, Patricia. Anyway, I have a friend of mine that came over and I just gave her like a box full of stuff and a bag full of stuff. I was like, do you want this? And she's like, oh, uh, yeah. I was like, okay, you can have it. And as she was here, I was just, I just kept throwing stuff into the box. So it's kind of funny. Anyway, that's why I bought these because I'm doing more organization. Um, so put that there. I keep wanting to put it over here, but my envelope that came from um, Peachy Cheap is over here. So, and I got the, well, I'll go over this first. This thing was cool. So this was Honestly, I don't have a clue what I'm going to do with this, but it was marked on clearance for 50 cents. So I was like, uh, yeah. So it says that it's an organizational folder and it says it's 11 and a, or 11.4 inches by nine and a half inches. It says it's got six durable poly pockets, holds up to 60 sheets, fits most three ring binders. So you have the three holes here. Now this on this side is like embossed together. You know how napkins are embossed around the edges? That's what it looks like this is too. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. So here's a pocket here. And these are like, these are plastic. They're not paper. There's another pocket here. Another pocket here. Another pocket here, here, and here. And then the whole thing is like closed off with the plastic sheet protector thing, my bomb. I don't know. So for 50 cents, I was like, I can figure out what to do with this because I have a lot of organization in three ring binders. So I can definitely utilize this. Okay, so. That just so went right at my feet. Um, Cause it's, it's gonna go in a binder. I just don't know which one yet. So I got two of these. And anybody who has been part of my channel for a minute knows I love like doing paper clips. Like right now, this is my paper clip bucket. Um, I don't know why I did that. Um, I have this upside down because it's almost empty. But this is my paper clip bucket that I have right this second. But I just took out half of this to put into a goodie bag for a friend of mine. So, yeah, I'm always doing paper clips. I may not always, like, do the videos on them because, I mean, I've done videos on paper clips a thousand times. So, but yeah, I'm constantly making paper clips. And so when I see various colors like this, I'm like, uh, yes, please. So I got two packs of these and these, this one, I actually got a similar thing like this uh, last summer, actually before I even started YouTube. And it was just your primary colors. It had um, the red, the green, the blue, the yellow, uh, white, and silver and black, I think were the colors. And that was it. But I really liked this because it's got those oddball colors. It's got teal. It's got that sea green, the really bl pretty blue, the uh, fuchsia color here, and the purple, and the white. I just, I really, really like these colors a lot. And these are the smaller paper clips. So they're not like super tiny. Um, they're this, they're this size. 
So, hello. Just one, please. Okay, whatever. Anyway, they're that size. So, of course, I had to get flesh colored paper clips. They're dummy. Anyway, you guys get the gist. The gist. I'm going to throw those on myself. Um, so, Target is another good spot to get like the Target dollar spot. That's exactly where I got this from. I got this last year. Um, and they come really, really full, and that's the only thing that's left. So, you might be able to see it better there. It's not really blending in with your skin when you put it on the desk. So that's it as far as the staples go. Um, and like I said, we went in there to get like refill inks for my husband's pen because his pen ran out of ink. Because um, he's weird and we don't just buy regular, you know, like ink pens in the packs. So anyway, all right. So this is from Peachy Cheap. And Peachy Cheap, what Peachy Cheap is, is it's a website. They change their deals out daily. So if you if you see a deal that you really, really want and it's really, really cheap, then my suggestion is to buy it because the chances of that exact deal coming back are slim to none. You might have similar deals with similar products and similar themes and this, that, and another. But to have the exact same deal is, it's, sorry, I was fixing my drawer over here. Anyway, to have the exact same deal, it's almost unheard of to have it more than once. So anyway, um, I got this, and it takes a minute to do the shipping. So it takes about, I want to say two, two to three weeks to get here. And it's, it's from America, so it's not like overseas shipping. Um, like this one came from Utah. Like, this is actually my home address, so I don't really want to show that to you. Um, you know, not that I don't trust you guys or anything, but I don't know if you could see it. Maybe. There you go. But anyway, like I said, it came from Utah, so it's not like... Um, it came from overseas, like AliExpress. AliExpress, I know, takes a while because it comes from Asia. Oh, it's open. Who oh, knew? Okay, so I think I accidentally ordered two of them. Oh, no, I didn't. Okay. I thought, I saw these two and I was like, did I order two of them? No, I didn't. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys these. And they're already open, so I'm going to go ahead and show them to you. But they're ephemera packs, and they directly relate to the Project Life cards that you guys just saw. So, there's this one here that is on trend, which goes with these ephemera packs, are this Project Life cards. So, open that up. And these look to be 3x4 Project Life cards. And if you guys aren't familiar with Project Life cards, they're basically just specific sized cards with curved edges. And sometimes they have pictures on them, sometimes they're solid colors, and sometimes they have sayings on them. Um, oftentimes they're referred to as Project Life cards because Project Life, I believe, was the first company to establish the system of it. But um, that's kind of like saying Velcro when you're referring to Velcro, but it's not all the same brand, but it's very commonly referred to by that brand name. You know what I mean? So, um, that's the same thing with the Project Life cards is it's very commonly referred to as the Project Life brand, even though it's not necessarily Project Life brand. Like these are not Project Life brand. These are my mind's eye brand but they're the same thing they're still little itty bitty cards in a specific size with round rounded corners making crafting incredibly easy so if you don't know what to do with project life cards and you would like to learn what to do with project life cards or would like to know what i do with project life cards or just different various ideas and i got dust all over my desk then let me know and i'll do some videos for you guys 
Um, and so this is the ephemera pack. I'm definitely not going to go over this individually. Just kind of going to spread it out for you guys. Um, but yeah, so this whole pack right here, I have three sets of the Project Life cards with three sets of the ephemera pack. So this set goes with this set. The life, the Project Life cards goes with this ephemera pack. And then this ephemera pack goes with these Project Life cards. And then this ephemera pack, which is, this one's also open. I, one of them was open, I thought. Maybe not. Um, this one is um, my story. Everyone has a story to tell. So this one goes with this one. Like so. And anyway, so this entire thing, all of these, three Project Life cards, three ephemera packs with $7.99 with $3.99 shipping. So it was about $10. 10 bucks, 10 11 something like that. And I don't know if you guys know this, but if you do know about Project Life, then you know that the actual Project Life cards are about $15 just for the cards. So they're, they're not very cheap, which is why I got these. This is cool. Dude, that's a foiled um, mandala. Sorry, I couldn't think. That is cool. I love these things. I love coloring them too. Those are cool. I have a whole coloring book of nothing but these. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, there we go. I had a little extra piece hanging off. That's really cool. And then the hearts. Okay, this is getting cooler and cooler. I got numbers. Ginormous numbers. Holy moly, look at this. These numbers are huge. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do with them. But, <laughs> they're really big. Actually... I have a, I have a calendar date that I have to, I like a page to fill out for um, my FRG and I can use those numbers for that calendar page um, because I'm doing August 31st. So I can do the three one there and I can just spell out the word August with, you know, whatever. Uh, so I'm just kind of rambling right now. But that's that's really cool. That's actually perfect because I have to do that like tonight. Um, oi, oi! Oh my gosh, I have to get another bag though because this bag is broken. Like it's split open the side, uh, which is how I got these out. See, so but that's okay because I have like I have these same type of bags like in my drawer right beside me so yeah it'll be fine so there's that one this one is on trend 2 so there's that one and then this one is I'll what I'll do is I'll spread this out and then go over the project life cards so it's not a ridiculously long video oh get up get out get out get out there we go okay so I'll spread these out. Oh, little flags. It's a bingo card. Oh, this is really cute. Oh, I like this one a lot. Okay, I like this one. I mean, I like the other one too, but this one, this one's cool. This one's like, it kind of has like a vintage -y feel to it. Like the, kind of like the 70s maybe? Did I seriously just call the 70s vintage? Gosh. Ugh. Man, this day and age. Okay, I think this one should go there. Dude, I'm getting glitter everywhere. Okay, so as you guys can see this in the background, I'm just going to go over this one over here. Um, so this one says love, flowers, and some glitter. Anyway, the abrupt stopping or cutting in the video was because I had a phone call. And for you guys that don't know, I record on my phone. So when I get a phone call, it stops the video. Well, something happened on their end and they hung up on me basically. And then they had to call me back. So anyway, 
Uh, third time's a charm, maybe? Possibly? I think I'm good. Unless, you know, some random person decides to call me right now, which I really hope that's not the case. Anyway, so uh, moving on with the Project Life cards. Uh, it says, the best thing to hold on to in life is each other. That is such a cute phrase. I love that. The best thing to hold on to in life is each other. That's amazing. That is really cute. I like that a lot. I think I'm going to separate that because I have a project that I'm working on right now for my husband um, and the FRG. So that, I like that a lot. This says uh, beautiful and your adventure awaits. Oh, that's really cute. I like that one too. Notes. Oh, that's cute. An apron. You got this. I shall like frame that and like just stick it somewhere where it's right in my face because I am my own worst critic. I really am. And I think that's the case with every person. Okay, so apparently the third time's not the charm because then my phone decided it wanted to cut off because all the like when I delete my videos, I actually have to go back and delete them twice because I delete them off my phone. And then my phone has a setting that says recently deleted videos. Well, then I have to go back and delete those off my phone too. So anyway, uh, I ran out of space needless to say, or long story short. Anyway, so I don't even remember where I was, but I was going over these things. My number one, oh, that is cute. I like that one too. So like I said, I'm, I'm working on the project and I just, I literally just gave away the other two that I had. Otherwise, I would show you guys um, what I'm talking about, but they're like little calendar p uh, pages, and it's um, it's it's for everybody to like kind of what is that? Kind of like remember a piece of home when they're away because um, if you guys aren't um, sorry, I'm like concentrating on this thing. Uh, if you guys don't already know, my husband is in the Navy, so he goes out on the boat quite often. And when he's out on the boat, the FRG normally tries to do things to kind of like, that are really nice for the guys. And what they're doing this time is they're going, they're making like calendar pieces and pages. That way, uh, whoever wants to buy a specific date can, and they can like dress it up and say, you know, happy birthday, sorry you missed the birthday, or you know, whatever it is. And so I, I did one for, um, well, I did a few of them actually, but for special occasions for us. And, and that's what the project is. It's, um, it's a calendar square. It's not even a square. It's an eight and a half by 11 page. Man, I am just so discombobulated right now. It is not even funny. My phone shut off twice in the middle of recording this. Normally it's, you know, quite smooth. I didn't think this video was going to be very long. All of a sudden, you know, I'm looking at like a 40 minute video. Honestly, I don't even know because it's cut into like three different videos because my phone kept cutting off. So I'm actually going to have to do a lot of editing on this one, which is so strange for me. Normally I'm just like, okay, put my intro, put my outro, peace out. Whoa, that's cool. I like that. So I recently saw a video. Oh gosh, who is this? Little Hot Tamale. Uh, if you guys are into li the library cards, uh, so if you guys are into the library cards, then um, then she has got this really cool project. I'll try to remember to link it. Uh, it's a really recent video. I think she just posted it like this past week or something like that. But basically you create this pocket and then you also have, um, she supplies you with like a printable that you can put into the library pocket. Really, really, really cool. And if you haven't already seen Little Hot Smiley, oh my gosh, she's so cute. I love her videos. They're so creative, love them. All right, some more Project Life cards. I'm gonna go through these while you guys stare at the stuff in the background. Nope. Yep. Yep. Do look at these sunglasses. That's cool. Butterflies. 
write your own story. More butterflies. An ampersand. That's kind of cool because you get this twice. You get the actual ampersand and then you get the imprint from it. But now it's not going to come out. Uh, this one says hello. This one says today. The heart. It's a typewriter. Oh, that's cool. Amazing reach. Every day. Fun. Always you. Moment. Every day is a new chapter in my life. I think my, my daughter's friend is trying to wake her up. And that's a very interesting thought. Because Haven doesn't really wake up very easily. She likes to wake up swinging. Yeah, babe. One moment. Do you have a, where's your I do. So, my husband needed a tool for me. So, anyway, I promise I'm going to get through this video eventually. This one says best day ever. Yay! Heart. You give me butterflies. Aw, that's so cute. A jar. Let's celebrate. Dream big. Oh, cool. They're like little banners and flags and such. So anyway, that is it. And that's peachy cheap. Like I said, I got all of this crap for, well, it's not really crap, but I got all of this for eight bucks. I mean, I had to pay for shipping, but that's what happens when you order online. But eight dollars. Absolutely crazy. Um, so anyway, like I said, if you're interested in the library card pocket and the library card itself, go check out Hot Tamale. She's got a video up. It's only about a week old, maybe two. I don't know. But, um, but yeah, definitely go check that out because it's really, really cool. Uh, I think that goes with there. I don't know. Yeah, I think this goes over there. So anyway, that's it for this particular video. That was Peachy Cheap and Staples and... I'm going to have fun editing this. So, so anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and until next time. Bye.